Hello, my darling friends, and today we're going to have a test for those uh, Montmartre watercolor cakes. So, the price in the shop is $10, nine ninety-five. And let's have a look what we will have for this price. I'm a bit excited because those ones are one of the watercolor cake set I've been waiting for. I guess that's beautiful and great for the kids because it has a lot of colors. You can see 36 in there and it also it has a color palette on the side, on the cup. Yep. So let's have a look how they're mixing together, how they dissolve in, with water and etc. So we have a small tiny brush inside of every set what is good and brush I guess is pretty good yep for the kids beautiful 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 mm -hmm. so let's have a look how they mixing together and what we can do out of it I want to create pretty simple cut it will take about five minutes to do so but it will help us out to have a look we will have any troubles or not with the color mixing. So we have a lot of colors. Let's try this pink. Looks good. And already I do have some color, as you can see. It's a bit whitish. Looks like um, some kind of gouache. Let's have a look how it's mixing together with the yellow. Pink and yellow, one of the girls' favorite. Oh my goodness, that looks spectacular, actually. I love this yellow. And let's try orange as well. Try bright orange. Uh, those watercolors, they are not professional ones. Wow, look at the color, it's so bright. Wow, I haven't expected that it was. I thought so they will be a bit more kind of duller. But let's have a look how they mix together. Mm. Yep, color is going inside. Move another one and we can see so how color seeing through. We can see it. Let's try some more yellow. I want to put more yellow for my work. So a couple more, more water. And you can see, so I just add a hint more water and it straight away becomes very, very interesting how they mix them together. Yeah, that looks so good. Look. They are not professional because, as you can see, the consistency of the color is not like from the amount of pigment, pigment inside of the cake isn't enough because we expect, so for example, if it's some blue, it will be very dark blue. But I guess for the kids, it's like not just more than enough it's very very good mm. look and what if you add a bit of pink inside i think yes definitely worth to spend ten dollars for the kids you won't need anything more basically good amount inside of each color so as you can see in two minutes I already created something looks what is the look very, very pretty let's try those greens 
And what is good? We have a lot of different colors. Kids sometimes they wanna add on the work some colors and do not know how to mix them. It will come a bit later, but I think so. That works for me really well. You can put couple spots over there, and you can see how beautifully the texture spreads. of yellow inside and a bit more so yes definitely I recommend to buy this set for the kids and even if you're an adult and if you're just starting do not spend like $100 for some sets of the watercolors it will be very fun if you will just buy something like that and have fun i want to try to do some paint very very mild and some go wilder And let's try uh, as well. We can put a bit of fun in there, like pink and yellow, yellow. I love this yellow. It's so bright, beautiful, medium yellow. So you can buy those watercolors and enjoy a lot of fun with them. It's what for we love our watercolors. We love the transitioning of the color inside. Let me try this nice. Mm -hmm. Looks good. What do you think? I think it looks very, very nice. Let's let it dry and in I will come back in five minutes and have a look how it will be bright or not at the end. Okay, now we can see so actually it stays the same, it's still not completely dry. But what I want to have a look, I want to have a look how one color will overlap another one. We have some small piece over there, but on this very, very first on this place, I want to have a look how they actually will work get one on top of another one. So, this place is dry or almost dry. I'm picking a dark color like blue. We can look. And I'm putting this blue on top. And as you can see, I'm putting very, very small amount. Like this. I do one wash on top of another one. And on the orange. Yeah. You can see, so we completely can see first color and the second spot. Mm -hmm. Have a look, the first pink one and the blue one, the primary. 
So let's try to do the same thing over there. Over there again we have already dry place. Yep. And let's try to do it with some um, blue one. Let's do blue one as well. It will make our work more consistent. Mm -hmm. So we have a bit of blue. And also I will pick this darker 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 mm -hmm. and we see yep you still can see this beautiful blue underneath our dark red so let's let dry let's try this one and after that we will add a couple touches with our uh, liner. our work with couple touches of liners yep because we want to do something out of our fast fast testing have a look i will show you what to do fabulous two minute job in this beauty you can create so my uh, opinion is my professional opinion is those watercolors are beautiful for your kids even for you if you do not make some uh, difficult transition in between the colors they cost only ten dollars and you will have this nice color palette with a lot of cakes in there and the box and the brush as well so go on our website www.art-classes.com.au and 
buy this beautiful thing it's very very nice for your kids and you so and create these beautiful cuts with your own hands see ya bye bye